I grew up in southern New Jersey. Put money together, we got $35, we got a movie camera. I was a monster kid. So in 1983, I was trying to find my way in the world of acting in New York. It was just a constant state of high anxiety. Probably since I was eight years old, all I would do is make movies. I had a pork processing plant, restaurants, a military career. We were basically children of Star Wars, Ghostbusters. I started making little films when I was around 10 or so. People were excited. A lot of people they had never worked on a film before. This was what we wanted to do. The whole process to me was kind of it was like the poor man's Roger Corman. You want to work on it? Sure, come on, you can work on it. I was in the phase where I was enjoying that I had a great ability to cry on cue. We were impressed. We were terrified. Ah, uh, here we go. Mind you, I'm still working out of an extra bedroom in my mom's house. There's all this gear, and I'm like, what is all this for? I remember being disappointed. Here I was, the lead of a film, and I was expecting Hollywood. What the hell was that? I decided it was inadequate. And what did we do? We didn't do anything. You didn't rob anybody. Nobody got shot. You've abused this crew and abused me. It's a movie. Relax. Did you guys get arrested or? Yeah. OK. Let's just see where this goes. Are we recording all this right now? Yeah. yeah. All right.